Hello guys, this is Reese from Bomberito St. Peter's Volkswagen in St. Louis. Today I'm bringing you a 2022 Volkswagen Jetta SE. This particular one is Oryx White Pearl effect on the exterior with Titan Black Leatherette on the interior. It features LED headlights, LED running lights, LED tail lights and turn signals and reverse lights. The new Jetta front end, the larger air intakes on the front. The new uh, chrome grille here with this large chrome band at the top and then also this split chrome band in the middle that goes right into the logo there and then also another chrome lip down at the base right where the bumper meets the grill body colored paint on the mirror caps uh, there are not integrated turn signals on the on the uh, SE this year so it's a dual color it's got the oryx white pearl on top and black on the bottom keyless access on two doors a little button right there on the door handle it keeps the nice bowl line down the side and this expanded black plastic area on the back here right below the reflectors the new volkswagen logo in the middle it says jetta off to the left in a new font and se off to the right this one does not have a sunroof. The sunroof was an $850 upgrade. You can get that. You can also get the black wool package, which is another $395, um, which is actually a dark anthracite wheel, the same wheel only in dark anthracite. Let's take a look at the inside. The door inset panel right here, it's leatherette right here. And then you do have this arm pad right here that's also trimmed out in leatherette with the angled cut right here. Uh, the silver tips on the window buttons here. You do also have a fuel filler door button and a trunk release button here. On the seats here, you do have uh, a um, contrast stitch right here, dual stitches here, right on the bolster there. It's a power seat as well. So you got power lumbar, power forward and back and up and down and then the seat back adjust here. The contrast stitch goes up the side here into the headrest, the manual headrest there. You do also have a contrast stitch there. And before we climb in, here's a look around. The two outboard seats have a fixed headrest there that's sewn in. The middle one is adjustable. There's a look at your car seat hookups there as well. And the armrest is also trimmed out in a contrast stitch here. And as we climb in, you have Volkswagen's digital cockpit. This is now standard on every Volkswagen model. This comes on Taos, Tiguan, and Jetta as well. Uh, it's supposed to be in the Atlas as well, and right now they're using a substitute digital cockpit for those. Uh, but you do get automatic headlights here. Also with this, uh, this digital cockpit, you have three main views. This is your first view here uh, with the tachometer. Then you have the uh, blended screen here, and then also the speedometer here. Uh, you can change what's displayed in that blended screen there. This side of the steering wheel here up and down arrows here and left and right are like a mouse that allows you to tab across and change things so if I hit the left tab now I have the settings button here and I can arrow down and change between no display economy average economy gear display oil temperature start stop setting uh, and then also um, I can do the same thing on the right side by tabbing over to the right and then arrowing to up or down and doing driving data and what have you there um, pretty nice you do have a temperature gauge over here on this side and over on this side you have the fuel gauge it's a telescoping leather wrap flat bottom steering wheel so i can pull out push in raise it lower it lock it where i need it am fm radio no satellite on this one uh but it's am fm and the backup camera is still an hd camera uh but it does static the uh, lines are static they don't move you don't get trajectory steering with this one so you've got the red line that signifies where your bumper is, the green that signifies straight back. Uh, you do also get App Connect, which allows you to do Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, or MirrorLink wired to one of these two USB-C connections here. So you do USB-C to Lightning for an iPhone or USB-C to USB-C for an Android. You do have a phone tray down here. This is not wireless charging though. You need to go to the SEL to get wireless charging, I believe. Uh, you do get heated seats on both sides, driver and passenger, and a dual zone climate control here. So I can adjust uh, temperature here. Uh, I also have a sync button where I can pair them up or I can turn that off and have individual settings on each side. 
the sync button is going to work the best and then i do also have the on off switch right there the menu button allows me to bring up this touch screen version and i can actually slide my finger up and down here and change the fan speed and also hit the blue side to go lower the red side to go warmer and also turn off the sync as well very nice um 12 volt charger port right here push button start is here your e-brake is there just lift up to activate put your foot on a brake and push down to release you do also have the auto start stop shut off right here and the eco button here so you can't shut off the e the auto start stop and turn on the eco button the eco button would disable that once you put it on so i'll show you here now the auto start stop is activated the the shut off for it i should say and if i hit the eco button it goes off because eco is your best fuel economy so the radios am and fm as i said before uh it's surrounded in piano black here with the vents down below the radios angled towards the driver and the vents down below i kind of like that setup there and you have a little louver control here where you can open and close the vents there and also over here on this side so you have a high vent here low vents here and uh, another high vent over there the metallic finish right here that goes into the door panel over here there's your glove box right there manuals are here and then you also have a ziploc bag here that has all your extras your tire warranty and what have you in there windows are all one touch up one touch down they always are um Here's a look at the leatherette seat for the passenger side. Same uh, contrast stitching here. Here's the loop to slide the seat forward and back. Over here on the side, there's no handle there, so you can't raise and lower this seat. It's fixed at the level it's at. However, there's a handle right there uh, to adjust the seat back pitch. Up above here, you do have the home link mirror with the four year subscription here. You got three buttons for garage door memory and a fourth Bluetooth button there digital compass up there and it is an auto dimming and then you do have an led i'm sorry a vanity light here minus the led light or even the incandescent light for that matter there's no light above so uh, it's just the vanity mirror on each side um carnet is right here your information button roadside assistance and emergency services buttons are all right there for you um down here let's look at the cup holder here nice same deep cup holder it's kind of st stadium seating set here where one's higher than the other so you don't have them bumping in each other if you buy two drinks and then you also have coin storage right here the armrest right here with the arm pad you lift up there's storage in here as well there is not a usb-c in here uh, i believe you're probably going to have to go to the sel to get that and then there's a kickstand here which you can actually adjust the level of the armrest here and then fold it down if you want it lower let's take a look at the back seat but well, before we do that here's the key fob uh no remote start on this one so you may be missing out on that no cold weather package at least not yet um that may come later as it did in uh, one of the early 2019 models uh, but there's a look at the back side of the key the volkswagen logo there the side has the panic alarm it's a super slim key so it fits in your pocket and doesn't take up all the space in your pocket uh, you have a lock and unlock button there in the trunk release as well let's take a look at the back seat there's a look at that alloy wheel it's the same wheel that was on the r-line for 2021 and 2020 i should say 2018 or sorry 2019 2020 and 2021 uh, it's the same wheel it's just a little bit of a silver color to it uh, the black wheel package will give you the dark anthracite so it's going to be a darker gray this one comes in at 26 225 extras on this one are going to include 395 for the oryx white pearl paint 375 for that auto dimming home link mirror with the four-year subscription 275 for the monster mats and 90 bucks for the the roadside assistance kit bring you to the 6 26 225 as you open the back door here here's a look at that back seat i'll climb in here nice boring blue and white socks today uh but we do have no magazine pocket here but it's a sculpted seat so i was just sitting in that seat up there i still have leg room and knee space back here about two inches almost three inches of space over there on that side there's a magazine pocket for the passenger seat there are no vents here the vents are underneath on the floor for both passengers in the back um, you do have a car seat hook up here right there and then over here as well for these um the armrest that folds down in the middle is squishy yet firm adjustable headrest over the top of this one the other two are sewn in or fixed just like that here's a look from the back to the front there's a look at your instrument cluster there center console armrest right there 
This one, as I said, does not come with the uh, the uh, panoramic sunroof. You can get that. And you have dome light here. So I try to push that there. It's an incandescent dome light there. You have it on each side there. And you have dome lights up front there. Let's take a look at the trunk. It says Jetta off to the side of that new font. It's a closer look. Here's a look at the back. The trunk is pretty huge. You do have seat pulls on either side. So you have a seat pull here and a seat pull here. You just pull on these guys here and the seats will fold flat. Here's your roadside assistance kit right here. Uh, rubber mats or monster mats right there. You do get an adapter to take the USB-C to USB-A and cargo blocks here that attach to this carpet floor as part of the cargo protection system right there. And then underneath this carpet here, over to the right side, there's a little slice right here where you can stick your finger through to pull up. There's a look at your spare tire right there and a jack apparatus inside of that. Remember the S does not come with a spare tire, just a can of fix a flat and a pump. And then you do have a handhold on either side of the trunk so you don't have to touch dirty paint or slimy wet or muddy trunk lid to close it. This car will come with a four year 50,000 mile bumper to bumper warranty on it from Volkswagen. That includes two years of free maintenance. So your 10 and 20,000 mile oil changes are covered. Also, if you buy from me at Bomberito St. Peter's, we're gonna give you a third year free maintenance as well. So your 10, 20 and 30,000 mile oil changes are all covered. Also, if you buy from me at Bomberito St. Peter's, I'm gonna give you a 10 year 200,000 mile nationwide engine and powertrain warranty free of charge. So if you're interested in this car, give me a call, 636-290-4257, 636-290-4257. I'm on TikTok, YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram at Reese Sells Cars. Thanks a lot, guys. Stay safe, stay, stay healthy, and have a great day.